let's solve this problem in this problem it is said that the car has an initial speed v naught 20 meter per second if it increases its speed along the circular track at s is equal to 0 right so we can write that v naught the initial velocity is 20 meter per second at s equals to 0 and we are given the tangential acceleration function right so at is given as a function of s right where s is in meters and it is said that determine the time needed for the car to travel s equals to 25 meters right so we have to find the time when the car is at a distance of 25 meters since we are given this tangential acceleration function right so we can write that this is we know that we have this equation v dv equals to a t d s right so we can write that this is a t is 0.8 s right so we will integrate this and this integration will be from v naught to v and this will be from 0 to s and from this we will get v square divided by 2 and this will be from v naught to v and this will be 0 0.8 s square divided by 2 and this will be from 0 to s right and now if we apply these boundary conditions so this will be 1 divided by 2 v square minus v naught is equal to 20 meter per second right so this will be 20 square and this will be 0.8 s square divided by 2 2 will cancel out so v square will be equal to 0 0.8 s square plus 20 square or we can say that this will be square root 0.8 s square plus 20 square now since velocity is ds divided by dt equals to this thing so if we take 0.8 common from this right so this will be s square plus and this is 20 squared right so from 20 square if we take 0.8 common so then that equals to 500 right so this will be like this and we want to find the times so we will write dt equals to ds divided by and now we need to integrate this so we will integrate this from 0 to t and this will be from 0 to s right so this will be equal to t and this integration will give us we can we can write it like this as well so it will be 0 to s this will be ds this will be we can separate this term right so this will be s square plus 500 right and we can uh, take this constant on the other side of the integration right so we can write it here so this will be 0 0.8 right and now if we take the integration so then this will be equal to ln s plus s square plus 500 under the root and this will be from 0 to s right and if, if we put the s value if we put this boundary condition and and then we put s equals to 25 meters right we want to find the time at s equals to 25 meters so if we substitute s equals to 25 in this equation so then t equals to 1.08 second right so this car needs 1.08 second to travel 25 meter distance along this circular track 